changed, it's all changed for the photographic project. That's why I'm doing mentoring. I want to keep doing it. I'll do it as long as there's classes and they'll have me. I'm there. I definitely think it's a good, good type of therapy for people that have mental illnesses. Photography gets me to go more places, to talk to more people, to try to look at things from different viewpoints. Being a mentor has been helping people learn how to do the different adjustments to the manual camera to, to get what they want. But it's also been helping them find subjects that mean something to them. Mentoring, uh, trying to help people uh, see themselves in their work. We have people who will say, you know, hey, you're, you're an individual. Be acknowledged as a photographer. Suffer from bipolar. And I wanted to be a whole person, and just I wasn't a whole person. I was just playing and acting out, and I was tired of it. I had some things I, I don't like talking about uh, that happened to me, uh, things that, you know, they say a paranoid schizophrenia. You're afraid, and, and, and you um, duck out. And... When I was first diagnosed, it was called manic depression, and now it's called bipolar type 1 with psychotic features, <laughs> which really isn't any better, it's worse. When everything's going too fast and you can't grab onto anything and everything feels out of control, mania is not ecstatic at all. The images you can pick up with photography is, is, is in its essence whatever's on your mind, whatever's in your, in your heart. And, it's maybe a little more extroverted here, in a good way. Not being, what, uh, or improper or obscene or, you know, anything like that. I don't want to do that. <laughs> it's like, it was like finding part of me that had been missing for years and years and years. And then all of a sudden, I like accidentally stumbled against it and went, wow, this is like Christmas almost. For one instant, for one picture of that particular moment in time, it's yours. I have to take pictures that will reflect this kind of uh, uh, stark reality of, of life. Uh, they mean something to me, and uh, I hope they mean something to you.